first of all, I know you love Hawaii. I do. And you surf. I do. And were you a really good surfer, or did you get better? Were you already good? All right. So when I got there, I was in all modesty, the stud, because I could surf. Right. And Dennis Quaid had never surfed, and Anna Sophia Robb had never surfed, and Lorraine Nicholson, who's in the movie, had never surfed. So we all went out, and I was, you know, they were freaking out. But as time went by, I learned that they're fearless, that Dennis Quaid went out with very little skill at first into huge waves. And so I would say in the continuum, I started uh, the stud, and by the end, they were out in big waves, and I was on the beach whining about how cold it was. So somehow uh, there was a flip. Wow. And, uh, I would always think that it's cold. I mean, it looks fun. It's Hawaii. I mean, but, it's really not Yeah, but the water's cold. I'm a whiner. I'm a stud and a whiner. Yeah, a whining stud. I am kind of a combination. You know, there I am, look big that. studly. That's, That's me. impressive. That's me. And look at Dennis. That's me. Yeah. And then that's me right there. That's actually me being a stud. And there you go, studly. Good. Still studly. Kids are, still studly. Are, very studly still. And then yeah. right after whining. Right after that whining. <laughs> I mean, and Dennis, you'd think that he is a surfer. He's got an amazing body. And he's, uh, it's, yeah. first of all, it's a beautiful film to look at. And uh, we had uh, her on the show. We had Bethany on the show right after the shark attack. Yeah. And uh, what an because incredible. She was, I heard she was barefoot. Uh, Yes, well, I you can see that. She was, you can be barefoot right, if you'd like. Barefoot. I mean, if she can be yeah. barefoot, will she, you be barefoot? She can do, uh, <laughs> go ahead. I'll, I'll, take, take, I'll, take, I'll take one shoe off. <laughs> All right. Thank you. I'm just going to take one shoe off. Okay, I don't want to commit fully. Um, <laughs> So, so, Bethany, if you don't know the story, it's the girl who was uh, surfing, an amazing surfer on her way to be professional, and, yeah. and uh, She's shark. 13 years old, uh, top of her game surfer, who was bitten by a shark and lost her left arm. This was on Halloween, and on Thanksgiving, one month later, she was back in the water. Back in the water. Yeah. And, and competing, competing a few months after that. I mean... Just, just paddling to get out there with one arm. You imagine? I went out with her and I thought, how is she not going in a circle? Exactly. How is that not happening? Exactly. I mean, have you tried it? I, and, and, to, and to have the strength to go against the current with yeah. one arm and no, then she's, much less balance. She's a goddess. I surfed with her, with my boyfriend, myself, and her. And um, we surfed, we surfed, we caught a wave together. So the two of us are thinking we're pretty fantastic. Uh, I'm here, and my boyfriend's here, and Bethany's here, and we rode the wave in, and what I found out later is that she had turned and was surfing in backwards because it was such a, it was a ridiculously boring, small, boring so wave for boring, her. We were like, and she was surfing with yeah. her back toward the beach. No, and, she's... she's like, filing her nail. It's, it's, and, and it's a beautiful... It, it's shot... Uh, it, is it Kauai? Where did you shoot uh, this? Uh, Oahu. Now, beautiful movie to look at in the story. I think it's because you know what it is. You already know that she's going to lose her arm. Yeah. But it was shot so well that you're like, is this a moment? Is this the moment? There yeah. were all these little moments leading up to wondering when it was going to happen. Yeah, her yeah. whole family was there, and in fact, her mother was a big wave surfer in Kauai in the 70s, and uh, had not gotten back in the water since this happened to her daughter, and I brought her back in the water. Good for you. The two Good of us surfed you. together. Wow. It was great. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. We were, um, it was, it was Sherry, the real mother, me, and some Hawaiian guys, and they kept looking over like, well, who is this woman, and why is she look uh, unlikely to be in the water and yet catching every wave. And I said, you know, Bethany, Ham Bethany Hamilton, that's her mom. And they were freaking out. They're, that's a long a real time to there. not do it and then do it. Did she pick yeah. it up pretty quickly? Yeah. Yeah, it was exciting. I can't see. imagine. I mean, just it just seems like the hardest thing in the world to, to surf. It's, hum it's humiliating for a long stretch. Because you're just falling yeah. constantly. Yeah, horrible. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, purling, they call it, which is the board goes that way. And it's a really bad feeling. But when you catch a wave, you catch one wave and you realize, oh, this is why people give up their whole life. You know, if you have breakfast and catch a wave, you tell yourself that's a day. That's like something, right. a way the person could spend a day. Right. Um, so it's, it's pretty fun and addictive. Yeah.